Oh, I got one more thing because I was seeing some comments about this. Uh -oh. And let me find I out. Think Geek it, is checking out the. He's dude, I'm, out I'm the in the social media now. You're, you're up there a, now. It's unfortunate. It's right. unfortunate. It's a, I feel like that that gives you a really good barometer though of <sighs> how people are feeling, man. Yeah, which I was. I, I don't worse. know if I'm surprised by this or not, but I don't think he had a bad game at all. I think it was. This is probably just based off one play. Do you know what I'm about to say? No, go ahead, man. Terrell Edmonds. People, people are kind of ripping on uh, him, saying yeah. he was people bad and everything. People want to bash Edmonds every Dude, time, bro. I, Stop it! I man. don't. God. I think there was one play. It was a play action mm -hmm. where um, maybe he, maybe he bet on the play action mm -hmm. a little bit. The guy got behind him, but then he made the tackle. Mm -hmm. Uh, there was maybe one or two times where Jones passed it to a guy in front of Edmonds, but the, but it him, seemed yeah. like he was probably in some type of zone coverage mm -hmm. there and made the tackle. Yes. Dude, outside of that, what did he do wrong? People were ready to crucify him on the uh, the was it the uh, Evan Ingram push off catch and even with yeah yeah because that was the one they got called back it would have been a first down even with the push off with Edmonds we t I tell you this every time if you not not just let's watch on Sunday and and throw a hot take out there if you watch him on tape. He is always in position. It's just the finish. Even on that play where Ingram pushes off on him and catches the ball, where does he end up at? His hand is on the ball while Ingram has two hands on it. Great catch by Ingram. Yeah. But he's in position to make the play. His hand is on the ball. That Dude, like, what are we talking about here? And like you said, all the other plays, when we really go down and look at it, a lot of the zone cover stuff, yeah, you're going to just tackle the catch. The, the biggest... I guess issue I had with Edmonds, he had one, it was a, a missed tackle he had, I believe this would have been to Sterling Shepard, right side of the remember. field, it was probably like a seven or eight yard, like we caught it at seven or eight yards depth, Edmonds comes down, bursts on him, just missed the tackle, he ends up getting a couple yards more, that was my biggest issue, I felt other than that man, the other catches were out of zone coverage man, like, I just think Edmonds, and man, I think I think uh, one or two of them were like late in the game yeah. too, when we were it's not like trying to like, give up you know, anything deep, it's like yo, Take, we want you to get this. Yeah. Keep the clock running, tackle it in bounds. We're good. But I feel like, man, when people have their mind made up on somebody, anytime they see them on the screen, they're just going to go hot take and, oh, I told you it was him. I knew it. <laughs> Bro, if they didn't throw the flag on Ingram, which was a clear another push off, we talked about that, right? If if they don't throw that flag, man, people were already bashing Edmonds. Oh, here Edmonds goes again. I'm like, bro, Edmonds has his hand on the ball right now. Great catch by Ingram. Great catch by Ingram. In fact, I was a little upset with James Washington because he had a similar situation where he had a chance to get the ball, jump ball like that, the corner on the right side. I remember side that, yep, yep. And the corner played through and knocked it out. But it's like, bro, it's the exact same situation. It's like, bro, he's right there. Like, it's not like how people are trying to make it, man. But you know how it goes, man. When people want to create a narrative, they just kind of just keep running with it instead of actually, like, breaking it down, watching it, and saying, okay, what is happening right here? Let's really look. What are they asking him to do? Just because he's in the vicinity, is that even his assignment? a la Minka Fitzpatrick on the crossing route, on the zombie concept, right? Just because he's there, is that his assignment? What's supposed to be happening right here? A lot of people don't know all the intricacies of it, and they just are quick to just, oh, well, everybody else is saying, let's just say it. I'm not a fan of it either, so I'm glad you did bring that up, man.